Hey guys, RC here, back with Football Manager 19. This is episode 21. So pretty good. We've, we've kind of reversed our fortunes over the last uh, stretch. So with Progresso, we had a nil-nil draw. Uh, I went back to the 4-4-2 against Boston River. Uh, we were slight underdogs, uh, very slight, but we ended up winning 5-1. Carlos Dorego ended up with a hat trick. Uh, Max Vieira with a goal, and Facundo Mendez ended a long goal streak with a second-half goal as well. Torque, we uh, drew nil-nil. Uh, Ruben Reyes was injured in that one. And then we edged River Plate 3-2. Vieira, excuse me, with an early goal. Uh, the Winter Soldier had a nice, uh, nice one. He was playing up top. We were playing our 4-4-2. Uh, in the two wins, so I think I'm going to close the season out with that. We're just looks like we're fading out a little bit with the uh, 4-1-4-1 uh, that we've been playing for a while. So I, I think I'm going to go back to that 4-4-2. We're having a little more success. But Vieira, Winter Soldier, and then uh, Mendez got a 94th minute game winner, so that was nice. So we're back for Danubio and Cerro checking out the competition. We're solid mid-table. Uh, I think we're going to hold on to that eighth. We could challenge to jump up into the top five with uh, a couple of wins. But uh, anyway, I can't believe the uh, board only reached 70% for making the final, even though we lost. But, yeah, whatever. Um, also, a little, uh, little bit of squad news. Uh, our captain... Teixeira, broken leg in that 5 run win. Uh, he's expected to be out for up to seven months, and he has discussed, now he's 31 years old, but he has discussed retirement. Uh, hadn't come out specifically, but he is uh, concerned about his ability to recover and so he is contemplating retirement. Uh, he is 31. We're going to have to really address our back line this offseason, uh, assuming we can move enough people. So we'll see. We'll see what's going on. Uh, that's going on. Also, uh, 15 and 33 for the Winter Soldier, 9 and 8 respectively for Vieira and Mendez. Cena has 6 in 13, so he's really been a force for us. And Durego, 5 in 7. So, again, he hasn't been playing a lot. So, I'd like to get him. <coughs> what that 4 4 2 does also allows us to play the Winter Soldier up top in a striker role and then bring Durego in on that left wing. So, kind of like that. Uh, on the assist category. Teixeira had, uh, was, of course, one short. He needed 11 to equal the club record. He's not going to reach that with the injury, unfortunately. Uh, Anthony Fowler has a shot at it, so he's got a shot. So a lot of assist, uh, some good spread on our goal, goal scoring. Uh, you know, one big score, but then we've got a nice range of guys with, you know, three, you know, four to nine goals each, and that's been really helpful I think in in stepping us up down the stretch. So we're back for the two final matches of the season. Uh, we are again eighth position. Uh, if we look at the overall table, we are still in third. Probably not going to reach second, but I think finishing top five is going to be solid. As long as we don't lose both matches, we'll be okay. But much like last year, we played really well and then kind of a let off. Uh, one last bit of information. We have uh, signed a player. He's going to join us at the end of the year, but he he's under contract. Uh, he's going to be a right winger. Uh, and uh, he's Chile, Chilean, 23 years old. And uh, pretty good physicals. Crossing's going to be solid. Dribbling's going to be solid. First touch is solid. Hopefully passing ends up on the high end of that, but, you know, seven to nine I think would be all right. Determination, flair, a lot, you know, work rate, technique. So he looks really good, 
and he has um, five star potential so that's what got my attention we were able to get him pretty cheap and uh, bring him in next year so that's gonna be a new guy coming on board but let's get to the matches for today uh, 80 81 59 on the ticket sales and we are underdogs so I'm gonna go with the I'm, I'm sticking with this 442 we've been playing well with it again winter soldier up top Durego able to come in seen as a little weak at the at that uh, midfielder spot I mean he can play it uh, you know what development Midfielder, right, wide, mid, attack. Let's just get him a little training there. Try to get him a little bit better. And let's try to get him. And him as well. Defensive, Volante, attack. Just get them working on on that position, you know. All right, let's get to it. Uh, Trabatini. Ferreira. He's only 19. And then Centurion. You know what? He well, he's you know, he's twenty five. He's 19. I want to play him to try to develop him. Let's do that. Let's do that. I've been bouncing those two guys around for the most part, but I think he's our better opportunity long term. All right, pick up where you left off. We're in the white. It would be nice, you know, to finish third. Uh, nice deep ball. Uh, put the pressure on him. Uh, wide open there. Wide open there. Oh, come on. That looked offsides. But it wasn't. Damn it. Fifth goal of the season. Oliveira picks up another yellow. We're only getting 36% of the possession this match. Hmm. All right, I'm going to try something. I'm going to try something here. We're going to move these guys up to support. And... Yeah, Barney's more of an attacker. Uh, Maderos, yeah, he's an attacker too. I can move Magalena's up. But 
I don't really have anybody for the back. In fact, I don't have anybody. I didn't even notice that. I don't have anybody for the back line. Fowler had to move to the right with the injury. That puts Rodriguez in. Rodriguez is our young player. Uh, yeah, yeah. That works. I suppose. Uh, disappointing and watch your step. All right, they made a switch at halftime. Interesting. Okay. Just watching that possession number right now to see if that gives us anything. Uh, let's see. Let's bring Andrade up top there. Actually, can he pass? He's got decent passing. All right, I want to drop him back to... Oh, yeah, that's not... Mid left. All right, we're going to bring him on for Dorega. And then what I'm going to have to do is that and yeah we'll leave those guys on support okay it's climbed up over 40 pounce pounce Cross the field, move into some space. Oh, and Oliveira is going to get sent off. Yeah, hey, what would a video be without a red card here down the stretch, right? Oh, you bastard. Bastards. Uh... You're going to go there. You're going to come back to there. You're going to go back to there. Uh, da, 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 Andrade. All right, you're going to have to stay up there. And I'm going to drop you back to here. Maybe. Let's see, Medina. All right, so Medina's going to swap. And then mid-center with Barney. There we go. Um... I guess. Gee whiz. Push forward. We're playing attacking. Yeah, I think this is going to be the final whistle here. Brutal. Oh, nice tackle. Wow. Yeah, we kind of got manhandled that match. Uh, disappointing, sure. 
All right, we'll see you here in a minute. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I guess we'll see you back here in a minute. Uh, Medina made his debut. Oh. How did he make his debut for us? Didn't it say he could not play? Didn't it say he could not play for two teams in a season? Uh, let's see. Medina, it's gone. We're not into a new year. Do you think that's a calendar year? It's the only thing I could figure because I know it was there earlier that he could not play for more than two clubs in a year. So I thought he was out for until next season. I wasn't even looking at him. That's funny. All right, we'll see you guys back for the finale in a second. All right, we are coming back. You know, I was just sitting here thinking. I was looking at uh, Fowler had come back with a 5.75 rating in training. So, you know, anytime it's below six, I, I get on them. But if you've watched me, you know I'm a Leeds fan. And prior to Bielsa coming to the club there's been a lot of talk about you know players would come in for a couple of hours for training and whatnot and then they'd be gone for the rest of the day well Bielsa's had the club spend quite a bit of money on training facilities and uh, recreational facilities to keep the players there all day and that the players now train on their off days eight or nine hours a day instead of two to three hours a day. And I know last year when he first started, that was some of the concern or some of the talk that his high tempo training uh, leads to some exciting football, but his teams have a history of fading down the stretch of the season. But I was, it, it, anyway, it just got me wondering, looking at, you know, some of the, conditioning and whatnot if you could mimic that because when you go with the default or you have your assistant manager do the training portion which I do um, they usually have the day before and the day after a match to rest and recover you rest before recover after but I was wondering if you you know if you could increase the number of hours a day or whatever and mimic that similar training style that Bielsa has and if that would lead to the ability to run more, be more fit, what have you. I, I don't know. Anyway, just made me think about it. All right, we are favored. I'm going to go with our uh, our main tactic here. There we are. Dorego, Winter Soldier up top. And uh, let's see. Trabatoni. He's allowed 14 in 9 with three shutouts. 39 and 27 with six shutouts. Yeah, let's go ahead and give Fierro the start, I suppose. Pedro Rodriguez is in the starting rotation now with the injury. Fowler's had to move over to the right side. Do it for the fans, those people that pay money to watch you play that you don't give a damn about. All right, boys, get creative. Oh, uh, speaking of uh, transfers, we just talked about the guy that we picked up. 
you remember that right winger that we had, Liet, uh, Lietis, uh, he, that we sold for, what, 115000 Oh, what a slide by Dorego. Get it in there. That was a beautiful goal. You don't see that too often with the slide touch. That was nice. Is that him right? No. Nope. Hello? I think that's him right there. Yep, that is him right there. That was a nice ball. Look at that. Oh, he just barely got the tip of his foot on it. Might have actually missed it. <laughs> I like that. That was a nice, nice goal. Very good. Let's give him some praise. Vieira knocked away. Stolen. And I think I lost my train of thought. I was talking about something. Uh, oh, Lietis. Yeah. Um, so anyway, I saw he was uh, just put up for $100,000 for transfer. Um. Still a really good player, but certainly I cannot afford that. <laughs> Mendez into the attacking spaces. Barney. Vieira just wide. All right, Rodriguez across. Barney. Oh, the Winter Soldier, number 16. Very nice. Fowler with Fowler got the assist. That's a new, uh, that ties the club record. That's his 11th assist of the season. Oh, he just slid it in there. Winter Soldier taps it home. 2-0. That's a nice way to finish out the season. Let's, uh... Can I see the league table here? League table. There we are. Um, yeah, so we've jumped up over Liverpool into seventh. We're not going to catch Penarol, so seventh is the best we can do. And that's fine. That is fine. Still top half of the table, right? Uh, let's see. Excellent effort. Fowler. Oh, Fowler got two assists, so he's broken the record. I didn't realize he had gotten the first assist. Way to go, Fowler. You don't usually celebrate assists or see somebody get a ton of those, but that's, uh, that's a great job. Stepping up, playing out of position at that, playing at that right back where he doesn't have a lot of, a lot of time. All right, boys. Now the lump over the top. Winter Soldier makes the run. Oh, he tried to tap it past the keeper. Oh, Fowler. Can you get another assist? Nope. Too heavy a touch there. Oh, boy, I thought he had a run in the channel right there. Oh, I was sweating that. Oof. They have got a lot of space in that midfield, it looks like. Diego Gonzalez puts one in. Sixth of the season. Come on, boys. Oh, don't. Show some passion. That was brutal. Brutal. Um, all right, you're frustrated. Really 
I'm gonna put um, I'm gonna put him in for Brazil. And then do I have a defensive left back? Hmm. Tell you what, let me undo that. I can move Martinez out there. And then put Quinteros in the middle. And then mid center. Medeiros? I suppose. Do that. Well, nice little angle pass up the field. Oh, into the channel. Off the woodwork, Ferreira makes a nice save. Looks like it might have been an offside because the way he dropped the ball there. Push forward. Oh, how did we not score that? Creative. Um, defensive mid. Magalena's for Anchetta, I suppose. Fowler's about dead, but I don't have anybody to put out there. It's the last game of the season there, my friend. You don't have to worry about it. Oh, do not FM us here. All right, come on. Push it. There you go. Nobody's up there. That's not great. Heavy touch. <laughs> Let us FM it. Oh my God, our guy did, Feller didn't even, Fowler didn't even go for it. All right, assist. Put it in. <laughs> Varney. Winter Soldier takes a touch. Oh my God. I, th I thought that was in. I thought that was in. Come on, boys. All right, good defense. All right, he just lumped it out trying to kill some time there. I was hoping to see a little more from Dorego here in these couple of games. All right, well, we pull a point. Not great. Good season, though. Very good season. Now, the Primera Division playoff. How does that work? Oh, you know what? We did win the interim. We might. All right, they hold out for a draw. Are we scheduled? No. That doesn't mean shit, though, right? Let's go ahead a couple of days just to see what happens with that scheduling. So I'll come back here in just a minute because what I want to find out is because we won that intermediate final, right? That may put us in the finals for the season. I don't know. I don't know if that's based on your final finish place or winning that cup uh, at the end. So we'll find out. So I'll be right back.
Uh, one bit of news. The Winter Soldier now has 64 league goals in his career, which is a new record. Uh, the previous, that's a club record. Uh, the previous record holder was Jonathan Dos Santos, 63 goals. Uh, so wanted to come back for that. And I am just kind of waiting to see what happens with that cup final. Or not the cup final, but the league final. Let's see if it tells us anything here. All right, Teixeira could win player of the year. Still nothing showing up there. And let's look at the calendar. It is here. I thought I saw that show up on the calendar. But now I'm not seeing it. I don't see anything up there. Oh, well. Uh, so we'll come back. I, I still want to look for that because I thought that was in a, in a week or so or a couple of weeks. But I also want to get to the end of the uh, season awards. And our U19 club won the, uh, won the league title. So kudos to them. All right, here's the end of season awards. Uh, so Max Vieira, fans player of the season, 54%. Winter Soldier, 19%. Winter Soldier with the goal of the season. Damian Ferreira on a free from Pinnerall signing of the season. And young player of the season was Vieira. Everything looks really good there. Confidence review. We are at 90% untouchable. They were not happy with our 2-1 to one Uruguayan Cup defeat. <sighs> Tactics has really fallen off. And that's end of the season. So I guess there was nothing at the end of the year there to worry about. Uh, let's take a quick look at the Job Center. Quite a few jobs are available now we're already in a two-star position and our profile we're now about two and a quarter stars yeah All right, Juventud, so we're currently sixth. But again, Argentina and Brazil is where I really want to go. Now, they finished 16th, which means they are not going to get relegated. How many matches do they play? 38 games. Oh, that's a lot of games. 38. So they're still early in the season. We could come in and do something with them. Possibly. Um, shoot, where did they go? Pharaoh. So their finances are okay. Average. Again, not the club I want to go to, but the club I want to go to is not there. Key player is a number 10, which I don't play. <laughs> that doesn't do me any good. Uh, hot prospect. 
striker. Not sure exactly how good he is. Damn it. Come on. Shit. It's just easier to do that. I get a lot of double clicks for some reason. Now the other option would be to drop down from number six to number nine, right? But the thought process would be, yes, it's a step back, but it puts us into, Bra into Brazil. It gives us a chance to compete to, for promotion into the first division. And then that would open up the door because we're already in Brazil to be in the top league and to get that Santos job, which is the one we want. Uh, let's see. Speaking of Santos, how are they doing? Sixth position. So... They're not exactly lighting it up, but it doesn't look like they're a Man City, Man United type club that fires their manager for finishing, you know, in second position, like, like CTB. That would be like CTB firing this manager for finishing one point off, you know. So that may be the way to go. We've got a couple of clubs. We've got CBR, CEA. Um, they're in 20th position. See, I don't know what any of these club abbreviations, except for Santos, I don't know what PAY stands for. Um, I would have to, I'd like to figure that out, but Fortaleza. CRB, JOI, yeah, see, I don't know what any of those mean. Um, they're okay, adequate. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of look through these. I may apply for a couple of these second division jobs. And... Uh, None of them are rich. Hmm. Where's Chilean First Division? Yeah, they're eighth. I don't want to go there. I wouldn't mind that. That would be a possibility. Argentina wouldn't be bad. So I may apply for that job or one of the second division jobs. One of these two and a quarter, two and a half stars. So I'll do that off camera, and we'll come back. Uh, next episode will be either at Job Change or back with Sarah Largo for the start of next season. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the season. And uh, hit that like button for me, subscribe, and um, we will see you next episode for whatever's going on at that time. Have a good one. Bye.